Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Yoyis and I'm a makeup and lash artist in Las Vegas. So I've been getting a lot of requests to do this video for you guys and I set it off for a long time just because it's not fully decorated to the point where I'm like happy with it i am happy the way i have everything set up i just recently changed everything around so i do like the way that everything is set up it just makes the room feel more spacious i don't have you know fancy wall decor just because i am very indecisive and even though i like one thing now i will end up hating it or just not happy with it later so that's the only reason why i haven't put nothing on the wall just because i don't want to be putting a bunch of holes on my walls and then not be happy with it <laughs> but i have a couple ideas of what i want to do in here i just i don't judge me guys, I know, don't judge me, it's getting there. I am thinking about doing a decorate my studio type of video. If you guys are interested in that, then let me know down below. I would love to bring you guys along on how I end up putting everything together. And if you feel like I missed little details in here, then comment down below and I would love to answer anything for you guys. But yet again, I will have everything in the description box like I do with every video. So if you feel like I didn't answer anything, then check in the description box because I for sure will have things mentioned in there where I got certain items at so let's just get straight to the video because you guys came for the video not for me <laughs> picture here my friend gave it to me a while ago and i wanted to hang it up right here since i have nothing on this wall but i'm still unsure like i said i haven't put nothing on the wall except my business beauty girl logo whatever you call her i'll show her in a minute but i'm still not sure of what i want to put in this wall i was thinking of putting all my certificates and all that jazz up here but at the same time i want to put a coat rack that way my clients hang up their purses or their coats I'm thinking of doing a separate video on decorate my studio with me but as you can see when you first walk in i have my computer desk and this is just a cute little lash box that i have so this is my computer desk nothing fancy this is just my phone so yeah, I got this cute little mouse pad and this pad from Amazon. And yeah, I mean, it's pretty basic. I have all my certificates are in here. I keep them all in one place. Then I have my headphones, you know, just basic computer stuff. And then I have this ottoman here. I used to have it right here, but the computer chair that I use, I also use it to lash my clients with. And sorry, my camera is all shaky. I don't know where I put the bottom connection to be able to hold the camera. I don't know where I left it at. So I'm just using my hands and the camera's a little shaky so don't mind it. But yes, this ottoman, I got it at, I think I got it at Ross. And I love it because I love everything tucked there. 
as you can see it's so cute and it's small and then down this way i have a full length body mirror uh, i did spray paint it myself it used to be a silver color and i spray painted it myself all right and then down here i have this cute little carpet this carpet i got it at, on amazon and i thought it was going to be a little bit bigger but it's fine because it fits in here really perfectly and I love the, the detail on it. It has like a flower in the middle. But it's super cute. And I'll have everything linked down below. That way you guys know exactly where I got everything from. And then this baby right here. My vanity. Isn't she beautiful, guys? I love her. She is so big. I reach up to... I'm like this tall compared to my... Like this tall compared to my vanity. And it still has all that room up there. Like, that's how big it is. So the vanity, there is this guy here in Vegas that he makes these. He custom makes them. His Instagram handle, I'll leave it down below. But it's pretty much the same guy that made my lash bed. And his Instagram is the Vanity Store LV. You can see, like, the difference. Like, it's so much bigger than my body length mirror. But it's so big. It has a connection here where I'm able to plug in everything that I need. And then it has the on and off switch it has six drawers on each side and they're spacious enough to be able to put a lot of makeup in there and if you guys do want to see just a full vanity tour video then I could do that for you guys I don't have that big of a makeup collection I have you know the basics just the regular stuff that I use on, on a regular basis. But if you guys are interested in seeing what's in my vanity, then let me know down below and I'll get that up for you guys. And this chair, this, this high chair actually came uh, with the set. It came included with the vanity through that same guy. So I really don't know where he got it from. But yeah, I love it because it has that tufted look to it. But yeah, that's pretty much my work agenda. This is just the case for my camera. And then I have my brushes, my fan, some setting sprays. And then this thing, this flower thing, it actually turns on. And I don't know exactly where I got it from. I have no idea. I've had this for many, many years already, so I have no idea. And then right over here, I have the um, this cute little board where i'm able to change out the letters and put whatever i want um, but this is pretty much just for my lash clients you know something simple so yeah that that's pretty much what my vanity looks like and that's pretty much the focal point like when you walk into my loft to my studio that's pretty much what you see but as you can see the walls are empty just because i still don't know what to put like like i said i'm very indecisive and I'm a huge procrastinator like I want to do certain things and I don't do them just because I know myself I know that I'm not going to end up liking it and I'm going to end up switching it within a week or so so that's why I have left the walls empty just because I move her around a lot before I changed her over to this wall she used to be on this wall and then I changed her over here and now she's back over here <laughs> I know guys I can't make up my mind but she is so beautiful I love her and I actually got this um, sorry I'm like all over the place but I custom made her through some girl on Etsy they're pretty much don't mind my nails guys I just took off some gel polish but I feel like in every video I have really crappy nails <laughs> but yeah these are my business cards and they're pretty much the same girl and when i saw this girl on etsy she actually has blonde hair so i asked the girl if she could custom make her hair black just you know to match me because i have black hair when uh she did them with the color black i was like you know what i need to blow her up and put her on my wall because she is so beautiful i love her like look at her lashes she's so cute and then she has like a flower crown i made my business cards 
and the big poster I got him off of Vistaprint. Um, Vistaprint always has good deals, so check out Vistaprint if you are thinking of doing something like this. And then I also have the girl that did my business cards from Etsy. I'll have her link down below, so you guys can go check her out too. I know she has a couple different designs of girls like this, and if you do have like a different type of style that you want, then you could always ask her. And then down here, I pretty much just have my lash bed. Down here, I have this uh, custom insert where I'm able to just put pillows and blankets and all that. But yeah, this bed was custom made through the same guy. Like, look at the detail on this. It's so heavy because it is made out of wood, so it's very heavy. The quality of this bed, it's so beautiful. Like, look at the detail. Like, I'm obsessed with tufted, like everything tufted. And this bed just screams out queen status, you know? <laughs> That's why I have my girl right here just to, you know, because this is my lashing section. I have my ring light over here. I have my lash pillow, my lash cart, and all my lash organizers, like... If you guys haven't seen my lash cart video, then go check it out. I'll have the link down below. You'll see in that video that I did have my bed by this wall and I had the bookshelf over here. And I had things arranged differently. But pretty much the setup for this is still the same. I haven't really changed anything other than my cleaning supplies are right here. And if you guys, right now, since it's quarantine, you guys probably haven't been able to find the Barber Slide Wipes anywhere. Like, I was looking for them to stock up, and I haven't been able to find them. So I ended up getting these from Kirkland. They're disinfecting wipes, lemon scent, and they are so good. Like, I'm telling you guys, these are so good. I use these to scrub down everything, like literally clean down everything. And then that has to be the best glass cleaner ever. If you guys haven't tried out that glass cleaner, then I highly recommend it. But yeah, I pretty much haven't changed anything on here. Still all the same. But if you guys want to see an updated lash cart, let me know down below because I am thinking of changing everything around. And then I just have my regular lash cart over here. I keep this empty just because I end up putting all my regular stuff that I use when I am lashing. Well, not at the moment, obviously, because, you know, we can't. So, but right here, I just put one of these pink dental bib wipes whatever you call them and then i just put everything on here to have everything set up for my clients yeah sorry about that guys i just feel like i was rambling on and on <laughs> forever <laughs> But yeah, nothing has changed when it comes to my organization. I am going to be updating it soon just because I feel like I'm running out of space already. Like I just did this and I feel like I'm running out of space already. But pretty much what I use my lash cart is to keep all my aftercare kits in there. I mean, nothing fancy. And then over here on the other side, I keep my business cards and spoolies that I give out. And then these I put in my aftercare. I mean, nothing fancy, you know, very basic. And then I do have a curtain hung up on this side because I ha it is a built-in bookshelf in there and it's brown and I'm not about the brown wood. <laughs> as you can see, everything's white in here. So I just covered that up and I use that as storage. And don't mind that I don't have a curtain on my window. I know I have a curtain on this side, but not on the window. And I do it just because I love how much light it brings into here. If I do end up putting a curtain, it'll probably be a sheer curtain like that probably even more sheer but yeah I love how much light it brings in here but yeah that's pretty much what it looks like and I'm still indecisive guys let me know down below if I should put all my certificates on this wall or on this wall I feel like I should put them here just because as soon as my clients walk in they'll be able to see them and then over here I'm I just I don't know what to do guys just give me some thoughts down below, give me some ideas because there's so much I would like to do but like I said I'm very undecisive and I'm still not sure what I really want to do. Maybe I should get like a neon sign or something. I think that would look really cute. <laughs> Anyways guys, so that pretty much wraps up this whole video. I'm just giving you guys an overview of what it looks like. It's nothing fancy, it's very simple try to keep everything very minimal and basic and clean you know that's why I keep it like this just because I love how much room it gives me and I've moved my studio around so much to the point where I can't move around no more <laughs> because I've had it every possible way but I feel like this way the way I have everything set up right now just works best for me it gives me more room like 
I'm able to still record videos in here for you guys and still have room in here. So I love the way I have everything set up for right now. I probably will change it in the future. Who knows? Most likely just knowing myself. <laughs> I know I'm so annoying. Anyways, guys, that pretty much wraps up this whole video. If you guys like the way I have everything set up, and if you guys would like for me to go into detail about my vanity, then let me know down below, and I would love to get that up as soon as possible for you guys. And yeah, so once I actually get some decor up in here, I'll probably end up doing a decorate with me kind of video. And if you guys do want to see that, let me know down below. Again, guys, you already know that I love you guys comments and anything you guys ask of or tell me to do you already know that i'll take it into consideration <laughs> but yeah that pretty much is it i hope you guys like it make sure to give this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe too and also hit the notification button so you guys don't miss out on all my new videos so yeah guys let me know down below what you guys would like to see next and i'll see you guys in my next video bye